Good evening. New Brunswick's Minister of Finance and a newly nominated Liberal candidate are speaking out tonight after someone created hundreds of flyers depicting them as puppets of their male colleagues. Matthew Bingley has that story. Courtney Pringle Carver won the Liberal Party nomination to run in Moncton's Northwest riding yesterday. But this morning, she walked to the end of her driveway and saw this posted to a telephone pole under the banner Liberal Party Feminism. It features several New Brunswick politicians, including Premier Brian Gallant, in this case, operating a robot version of Pringle Carver. Next to her is a marionette version of Finance Minister Kathy Rogers being operated by her fellow cabinet minister, Roger Melanson. Now, this is exactly the kind of political discourse that Pringle Carver says is keeping women and other diverse voices from seeking public office. But she says this isn't going to keep her from making a run. I think it's important that we rise above this level of discourse and in no way has this impacted my commitment to my community. If anything, I would say that it's strengthened my resolve because people need to know that public service is important and that people who want to serve the public won't be deterred by these kinds of messages. Now, I also spoke to Kathy Rogers this afternoon. She's incredibly angry that someone would suggest that she's under the control of someone, especially a man in this situation. She says that's not the case. She actually says that she spent the morning cleaning up after these because what wasn't posted to a wall, she says, were simply tossed out of a car window. Now, as far as what this says about feminism within the Liberal Party, Rogers says that's not represented accurately here, that her party is actually trying to do exactly the most it can for women's voices that it can. Matthew Bingley, CBC News, St. John.